Alpine head unit I'm putting in my 89 Mustang it's an IVA D310 as you can see lots of wires and hopefully I can hide them in the car pretty good and this is what I'm replacing an Alpine cassette receiver TDM-7544 with CD shuttle control set deck and it only has one pre out so no good to run subs and multi multi amps for your speakers and everything with only one set of pre outs so it sounds like a good reason to replace it and as normal with all these old vehicles somebody decided to cut out the plug the factory plugs and just wire it indirect so we're gonna have to cut all this out and figure out what's what to wire in the new wiring harness. That's always fun. As you can see, it's alive. Now it's time to hide everything in the car. Well, it ended up. The piece wouldn't fit in the dash. So I'm going to put it under the seat. But then to do that, i got to pull the whole center console apart to get the wires to go under the seat. It doesn't look too good when they're sitting like that. So, that's what I'm doing now. Now that the center console's all loose, we run the wires underneath and run it under the seat to get to the brain. I got the wires tucked in the best I can, but when I change the, uh, the carpet, I will run the wires all under the carpet. And now I just got them going around the, the seat post, the back, 
I don't have to do till I change the carpet. A lot of wires to try to hide in here. And while I was hooking up the front speakers, I also decided to hook up the little three inch, or three and a half inch, I believe it's three inch, on a dash. Now I just gotta upgrade those. All right, well, now all the wires are connected. I hit the module for the, the uh, iPod up under the dash. Now I just gotta get all these wires in a dash, and then I can uh, mount the, uh, the deck. Oh, all the wires are in. I'm running the bolts back together. Except for the tender console, of course. Now I gotta put the deck now in. I'm just trying to figure out how to hook up the parking brake and the brake wire so I can park and watch movies and stuff. So there's the e brake switch and see what I can figure out. And it's all back together. All good to go. One more thing done. Now just upgrade the rest of the stereo.